Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new tutorial. This is the Photoshop and photography tutorial. This one is the photographs. Uh, I got this one yesterday and that reason I just made this preset and the tutorial as well. Just because of some of my fans asked me and requested me to make the preset like that, uh, the light in a outdoor or urban type light portrait uh, the main image that is the non edited image i just uh, took this one and after that i edited this like this and like this so i give in the post uh, next tutorial is coming in my youtube community and other uh, social medias so let's start the tutorial if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications i'm closing this up and go to the file and open up here is my image which is uh, the non edited image press ctrl j so i got this picture and what was the settings i made the settings uh, in, uh, like uh, i used a device which is nikon d610 and 50 mm lens and setup was uh, uh, 160 shutter and f2 for the aperture and i also was 1600 so this one was the settings and white balance the most important thing of the night type photography is a white balance that was uh, minus uh, 3.5 that's good and go to the filter camera raw filter you know camera raw filter is a plugins of the photoshop if you have this plugin you can use it easily but uh, if you don't have these plugins please check out my video description for the download link adobe providing you that download for the camera raw filter here is a load settings options small menu and i used or i made this preset urban light and open it up yeah and what i have done here this one is the main thing of this tutorial if i discuss this one detailing or detaily you will get the best result or you learn something from here so temperature minus 16 tint plus 27 temperature and tint temperature i made it a little bit cool just because of this one i just given a cyan type effects and plus 27 that is a little bit like purple and exposure plus 0.15 and highlights i just down the highlights a little bit just because of i want to uh, expose the fairy lights here and minus 43 that's why and shadow i want to make it like darker type and uh, the model will be prominent that's why and uh, the face will be shadow not too much so that's why i made it plus 15 if i make it like that shadow will decrease but i want to take the ambient light as well that's why the shadow is plus 50 and blacks i made it down a little bit for the ambient black one and here the variance or vibrance whatever you can tell me tone that is actually minus 33 and here the rgb you can lock over here if you press over here it will be locked and here i locked two points and i made it like that so why i have just done this um, these options that means the last portion is for the matte look if you increase this one it will be more matte but i just made it like a moderated matte and then green i didn't touch blue i didn't touch yeah blue i just worked over here here is no like uh, graphs that's why i just made it like that you can make like that so it's up to you it's totally up to you how to do that i just given you the way here the detailing options i made the sharpen or amount of sharpening that is the 60 and the luminance that is the 41 and noise reduction actually uh, when you're getting some perhaps in a night you will get uh, some like noise you have to reduce that that's why i just made it 41 don't make it upper 50 it will spoil your photographs so here the hue saturation and luminance hue you know that the color belt which color you will select in your photo it will define with the hue and saturation how deep will be the color or how light will be the color and luminance the 
द एक्सप्रेशन अब द कल दैट मीन्स इल्यूमिनेटेड दैट द डीम टाइप और दिट इज इज वन इज अ लाइट टाइप इट डिफाइन्स विद इल्यूमिनेंस सो हियर दू आई मेड इट माइनस फोर्टी थ्री फॉर द एम्बियंट पिंक ऑप्शन इफ आई मेड इट लाइक दैट इट विल बी ऑरेंज टाइप सो आई डोंट वॉन्ट टू डू And here the orange color minus forty six, yellow plus fifteen, green color plus twenty three, minus thirty six, aqua and blue minus eighty two, and purple minus forty three, and magenta plus twenty. And here I made it blue for the uh, blue to purple just because of here you are getting the purple type looks that is the cyan looks, and the saturation here. the orange saturation plus 10 uh, just because of the lights and other stuffs and yellow i made the saturation plus 33 and other stuffs here aqua i made the saturation up just because of the cyan color is mostly prominent here and purple i made it down and minus 88 for the magenta split toning i didn't touch the highlight split toning i just used here the shadow split toning shadow split toning that is 191 and saturation 10 so what is split toning some of my fan asked me split toning that means splitting the tone you are splitting two things highlight and shadow and what will be the highlight color and what will be the shadow color that is defined with the splitting tone or split tone Here no lens correction issues. Here I made little bit dehaze minus two. That's why, and the camera calibration most important part of the photographs just because of here are three primary color red, green, and blue. And here I made the red primary minus plus fifty seven actually. You and the saturation plus twenty three. Green primary minus twenty and saturation minus twenty, and blue primary minus six and saturation minus two. And hit the OK button. You'll get. the look which is uh, before one and after one actually the ambient and the other stuffs will be more amazing if you use these the preset you can download this preset in my video description and this one is free of cost okay press control j now i will add another effects from the nick collection go to the filter and nick collection and color effects pro 4 so this color effects pro 4 is a plugins of the photoshop if you want to get the download link please check out my video description so it's taking time to load it up and preview the image and from here here is the colorize option and here are lots of colors and things you can use one of them and i am using the number 4 here is the strength option if you need you can change the strength option if you need you have the shadow and highlighting options to change and here is the color picker you can pick up any kind of color from here or you can just define the color from this color palette so i am using the preset that is the four and you can use that for your purpose and here is the like uh, iso or other stuffs iso 1600 and 13.6 megapixel and nikon d610 all the image detail just showing over here asm just because of this one is my camera and hit the okay button it will take time to load it up and give you the final output and it will provide you the best look for your photography purpose so it just change the image that's why i made it 50 the fill color and the opacity i made it 50% so it will mix up with the previous one and it will give you the extra look so you can reduce the opacity or fill color if you need you can adjust this one like that so you are getting the ultimate result of this is the go to the adjustment layer and levels options you can adjust the levels and other steps so i'll adjust the level from here okay so before one was like that that is not professional look but here you are getting the professional look and the ambient and light that is totally giving you some emotions and the expressions of these photographs so night day photography is like that uh, if you want to highlight the emotions and lights you can do that and you can use that preset for these purpose thank you so much thanks for watching my video tutorial if you have any kind of question query or request please do comment on my video comment section and i just given all the download link in my video description if you need you can check it out and you can download that 
resource files actually the preset and you can use in your photographs and don't forget to give that photographs what will be or what is the output you just got in my inbox or in my comment section so don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon for the new notifications new amazing things are coming next until the next video i am signing up today bye bye